This is Dave Langston with the Western State Sportsman Outdoor Show. I'm here with Guy Eastman, Eastman Outdoors. How you doing, Guy? Good. How you doing, yeah, Dave? Yeah, pretty good. Hey, you know, we see you all over. We see you on TV. We see you at the shows, you know, talking and SHOT Show. Um, what do you guys got coming up for uh, 2008? You know, I know the shows are done, just about done for us, too, but... Um, we've got hunts coming up. Uh, and you've got DVDs. Uh, what's going on with these right, outdoors? Right. Well, you know, our, as you know, the shows are winding down, but then that's when we start the application process in the summertime. We'll, so we'll start planning our fall this summer and, and see what we get back on the draws and applications. And, uh, and then, of course, it's hunting season. We'll start hunting about the 20, 25th of August and uh, hunt right. clear through to almost the new year, all right. the way to. Uh, to December. Right. Now you guys specialize, is it in western hunting? Yeah, it's only, all or? western big game hunting. Okay. So, uh, we do some caribou stuff, uh, you know, in like Quebec, but it's all big game, all western big game. Elk, right. elk uh, sheep, moose, deer, antelope, mm -hmm. uh, yeah. whitetail once in a while. And you specialize in also in something else, which is uh, public land hunting, right? Right. Yeah. I mean, you don't do any... Uh, fenced in hunts or anything like no, that. No, we don't do no. We don't do any high fence hunting, and and we do we do hunt on private property now and then. But a majority of our hunts, over half of them, well over half of them, are public land. Uh, do it yourself. So, you know, we're kind of hunt just like everybody else, kind of right. the hunter's right. hunter kind of thing out right. there with everybody else. You know, showing guys that there's a lot of opportunity available out there, even on public land. You know, a lot of guys think it's all gone, but there's some great hunting. Oh, available. there really is. Just you know, number one, get out of the truck. Yeah. Number, number two, get off the ATV. Yeah. You know, just get back in there. They're there. The animals are there. Yeah, exactly. And the states are doing a good job of managing the wildlife for the most part. Some states are down and some are struggling, but still, you know, there's a lot of opportunity. But you have to do the research and work harder than the, the average guy's willing to work. I mean, right. that's what it comes down to. It's a competitive business for anybody who's hunting on public land, you know, and so you just have to go further, harder, and and a little, uh, put a little right. more effort into it than the average guy's willing to do, and right, you can come yeah. out with success pretty, pretty handily. Exactly. And what are you going to be talking about here at the ISC over the weekend? Okay, and that's what I'm talking about. You know, I do a lecture each day. Uh -huh. uh, it's the same lecture each day. I'd, I'm not smart enough to alternate them. Uh, uh -huh. I get thrown off track. So I do the same lecture each day, and it's on public land do-it-yourself hunting. We're going right. to talk about deer, elk, and antelope. Um, I just talk about you know hunting on public land, do it yourself, some tips and strategies and techniques, and I have a video presentation that flows along with it that we you right. know kind of follows along with what I'm talking about and shows some some hunts and I talk a little bit about layering and gear and then some optics mm -hmm. uh, equipment advice too. Right, and now you guys have a website. You know this yep. is a web show that we're right. doing. Um, uh, so how can they find Eastman Outdoors? What is your website? Our, our, it's really easy. Our website's just eastmans.com, E-A-S-T-M-N-S.com, no apostrophe. Okay. Real simple. You can get on there and get uh, clips from the TV show and promotional downloads for of the videos and DVDs and that kind of thing. And then over at mossyoak.com, we, we have uh, actual episodes that are downloadable of the TV right. show. Yeah, yeah. Uh, now, the channels that you're on on television, what are those? On, we're on the Outdoor Channel. Okay, all right. And that's, that's the only one we're available on other than the webcasts that are on. Mossyoak. And you have a weekly com. show? or? Yep, it's on every week, Tuesday night at 9. Uh -huh. I'll tell you, it's tough, but not the content, isn't it? Yeah. It really, yeah. it can be tough. But We, we go year-round, so we do 26 hunts a year 26 episodes so right that's uh that's a pretty substantial chunk to bite off yeah and, and, fall. and we're not always successful no no that's Never. the thing people on t you know they watch tv and they get a little jaded view of how successful the average hunter is and that right tv is not reality folks exactly. trust me that it, it doesn't work out every time you go out right you know i had the same conversation with brad ferris of primos so right we sat down uh at the primos uh uh, table uh, behind the curtains. We sat there and talked for a good while, and, and I told Brad, I'm like, you know, we burn hours and hours and hours and hours and hours of tape, and we, we'll get nothing. And then it, it, it's just that 30 seconds that we want, and yeah. and you know, and we right. get, luckily we get it, and you know, hopefully we make the shot. Yeah, the, but, the average TV viewer audience sees probably about the, <laughs> the 28 highlight minutes of a four or five day hunt you exactly. know so they're seeing basically the highlights and hey unsuccessful hunts don't make for very exciting television so we don't really broadcast those generally but so a lot of people just think that 
that we're successful all the time, and that's not the case. They're just not seeing the unsuccessful hunts. Exactly, but, exactly. You know, we're just like everybody else. Right. And you know, tomorrow we're going to interview Cameron Haynes. Yeah, And I'm, I'm excited about interviewing Cameron. Yep. Um, and I'm excited to come down and watch, uh, you know, you guys uh, right. put on your presentation. But yep, I appreciate it, guys. Yep. All right, thank you very right, much, Hey, thank Dave. you. All right.